Yeah. All right, I'll be there. Bye. Who's that? One of the guys on the soccer team's having some people over for Halloween. He just wanted to tell me what to bring. You know, I don't think that Mark has any plans on Halloween. Could you take him along with you? Mom, I'm supposed to bring the chips, not the dip. What about you and Lauren? You're going to a costume party, right? Yeah, we're going as the scariest people we could think of. Republicans. Well, why don't you take Mark along with you? That's a little too scary. Hi, sweetie. How are you? I'm worried about Mark spending Halloween with that weird new friend of his, Ronnie. Hey. Hey, Mark. Oh, hi. Hey, Ronnie. I need to borrow the video camera. What for? Well, Ronnie and I are in a film class and we're making a movie. Let me guess. A fun-filled romp with some musical interlude numbers. It's a horror film. That sounds really cool. Yeah, I was hoping the whole family could be in it. Yeah, that sounds good. Gosh, I haven't acted since high school. Of course, that was just a couple of years ago. That was a joke. Good one. Come on, Ronnie. Let's go work on the script. Ready? Yeah, uh, uh wait. Yeah. Okay. Action. Hi, honey, I'm home. Hi, sweetie. Look, it's our two sons, Chad and Andy. Hey, great news, Mom and Pop. As you know, I'm very athletic, and today, as always, I scored the winning touchdown. Cracker Jack, son. That's wonderful. Have a cookie. Thank you. And how was your day, Andy? Dandy. <laughs> I've been accepted into Harvard and every other college in the Western Hemisphere. We certainly are blessed to have two such smart children. No, Father, it is we who are blessed. Because we have such great parents. Oh. <laughs> and cut. Yeah. Honey, um, are, you, are you sure you want it that exaggerated? No, no, it was perfect. Come on, Ronnie, let's get out the backyard from that scene. <clears throat> Suburban House of Horrors. Is that the one where you burned down the garage or filled the basement with sewage? This is Mark's movie. Oh. Too bad. We promised him we wouldn't look at it. Otherwise, we could watch it and make sure he's on the right track. Get a better feel for our characters. For better performances in future scenes. Oh, well, we made a promise. We always keep our promises. Do we? Not always. So. Perfect parents. The perfect sons. The perfect family. Except for the family member they ignore. The outcast. The forgotten son. Clark. But Clark's got a plan. And when he's done, don't be sorry. Very sorry. Hello, Dr. Wilson's time. I need a potion. What is your pleasure, Clark? I need something that will make my family look as weird as they think I am. The number six. <laughs> Thanks to Dr. Wilsonstein, I've turned my horrible family into zombies. Now I have the whole house to myself. Oh, Clark. Well, almost to myself. More Ruthie? Don't mind if I do. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Clark. Parents. What are you going to do about them, Clarky? I'll tell you what I'm going to do. It's time to say goodbye to them. Forever. He wanted to make a hideous movie. He delivered big time. This stuff is great. No, no. This film is about a boy who thinks that his parents favor his brothers, so he turns them into freaks and kills them. He's finally interested in something. Let's not screw up something he's excited about. He's excited about killing us! At least it's something. Mom, Dad, we're almost ready for your scene. This is creepy. This is great. Mark just wanted to see how our heads would look in a basket. You know, I've often wondered that myself. We're gonna go get our costumes on. If you were gonna be executed, how would you dress? Very slowly. Ready to die. 
Mark, Mark. Look, you know, just because it's a horror film doesn't mean that everybody has to die. You're an actor, not a dancer. Your job is to say the lines. Okay, let's die. Yeah, you first. Good, 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 good. This is a real blade. What? This is a little dangerous, Mark. Come on now. It's only for this shot. I need a light reflecting off the blade. Roll camera. And action. And, and, and talk to us now. Can we make this quick? I got a picture to shoot. No, no, we are not going back out there until we've had a talk. Oh, this movie has us very concerned. Why? Because it's about a boy named Clark who, who who thinks his parents favor his brother, so he what gives him a potion and turns them into freaks and kills them. You watch my movie? For the last couple of months, you've been really quiet and withdrawn. Maybe that's just how I am. You know, I'm not like Brad and Randy. Nobody's asking you to be like Brad and Randy. You're different. That's okay. Doesn't seem okay. Look, honey, just because I may not like one of your friends, or, or your movie is so good that it freaks me out, doesn't mean that I don't love you as much as I love your brothers. You're not just saying that? No, of course not. We're your parents. We're, we're here to help. Do you really want to help? Yeah. yeah. Let me chop off your heads. <laughs> as long as it's okay with your mom. How can we deny our youngest son the simple joy? But let's use the hard rubber blade, okay? Yeah. <laughs> shot. Perfect. Just need one more shot. Mark, you can take these doggies off our faces. They're kind of hot. Sure. Yeah. Oh. All right, uh. Ronnie. Just move the basket a little closer to the cauldron. Yeah. I feel so much lighter. Yeah, me too. My pain I was having in my back? Gone. <laughs>